Well, I mean, we've been sending unmanned spacecraft all over our solar system for decades. You know, in the 1970s, we landed Titan on Mars. Um, you know, any trip that is beyond uh, the Earth, the orbit of the Earth, and beyond the moon is something that we're not capable of doing right now with people. So if we want to explore the solar system, we've got to do it with unmanned initially. Um, the goal is to eventually get to the point where we can send people, you know, beyond the distance of where the moon is. The moon's about 325,000 miles away. It takes three days to get there. To get to Mars with current technology takes six months. And then when you get there, you can either stay for a month or you can stay for a year with no option in between. So we've got a long way to go before we're able to send people to explore the rest of the solar system. I think we'll get there. Um, one thing we need is what NASA needs, what you know, people that want to explore space needs. We need the support of the public to do something like that. And that kind of project is pretty, pretty significant. It'll cost a lot of money. And there's a lot of new technology that will have to be developed. Um, but until we get there, if we're going to continue to explore our solar system, you've got to do it with robotic spacecraft.